Hey everyone, it's Jess. So, I see I got a couple of replies for me to do a dramatic reading of My Immortal, which is probably dubbed, I shouldn't say dubbed, it's probably one of the worst fan fictions ever written in the face of the world. I want to give a shout out to Jade for doing a really awesome job reading it, and you did a really great job putting up with the horrible grammar and everything, and Honestly, I give you kudos points, and basically the only reason why I'm doing this is because I've had a really crappy day today. Um, not really going to go into too much detail, but I need to make myself feel better, and I just decided what better way than to read this atrocious crap and be overly dramatic about it and have some fun. Plus, I'm home alone and I got really nothing to do, so here we go. Chapter 1 of My Immortal. <sighs> Great. I'm just preparing myself for this because I've read it a lot and it doesn't get any easier. It just it actually gets harder, I think. Author's note. Special fangs, get it, because I'm gothic, to my GF, ew, not in that way, Raven, bloody tears 666, for helping me with the story and spelling. You rock. Justin, you're the love of my lot, depressing life, you rock too. MCR rock. Um, just, I want to give out a note, I'm probably going to misspell, not misspell, I'm going to probably mispronounce a couple things, um, because... Really, I don't care about a lot of these characters. I don't care about the story, and I don't care if I pronounce names or anything correctly or incorrectly. I'm not going to try. I'm not going to try my best to make it sound good, because honestly, it doesn't sound... it's not good. So here we go. Dramatic reading of this atrocious crap. Oh, hold on. My Skype's going insane. Uh, just give me a minute, guys. I'm sorry about this. I should have been ready, but... Fuck it. Uh, wow, I spelled dramatic wrong. I'm just like this author. Crap. It's rubbing off on me! Hi, my name is Ebony Darkness Dementia Raven Way. I have long black, ebony, black hair, that's how I got my name. The pep, with purple streaks and red tips that reach my mid back, and icy blue eyes like lipid tears. And a lot of people tell me I look like Amy Lee. Author's note if you don't know who she is, get the hell out of here. Peace, bitches. Not leaving. I'm not leaving until I get this done. I'm not related to Grey Odd Wade. I know I pronounced that wrong, I'm sorry guys. But I wish I was because he's a major fucking hottie. Oh yes. Very hot. I'm a vampire, but my my teeth are straight and white. I have pale white skin. I'm also a witch, in case you didn't know that. And I go to a magic school called Hogwarts in England where I'm in the seventh year. I'm 17. I'm a goth, in case you couldn't tell. And I wear mostly black. I love Hot Topic. I buy all my clothes from there. For example, today I was wearing a black corset with matching lace and it was and a black leather miniskirt, pink fishnet, and black combat boots. I was wearing black lipstick, white foundation, black eyeliner, and red eyeshadows. In case you didn't know, she's wearing a lot of fucking black. With a little bit of color. I was walking outside Hogwarts, and it, w it was snowing and raining, and there was no sun, which I was happy about. A lot of preps stared at me, so I put my middle finger at them. Screw you, perhaps I don't care. I'm every fucking way. 
Hi, Ebony, shouted a voice. I looked up. It was Draco Malfoy. Oh, be still, my undead heart. What's up, Draco? I asked. Nothing, he said shyly. But then I had to go. My friends called me, and I had to go away. Adieu. Adieu. We shall meet again soon, my love. Chapter 2. Author's note. Thanks to Bloody Tear 666 for helping me with the chapter. By the way, perhaps stop framing my stories. The next day I woke up in my bedroom. It was snowing and raining again. I opened up the door to my coffin and drank some blood from the bottle I had. My coffin was black ebony and inside was hot pink velvet with black lace on the ends. I got out of my coffin and took off of my giant MCR t-shirt, which I used for pajamas. Instead, I put on a black leather dress, a pentagram necklace, combat boots, and black fishnets on. I put on four pairs of earrings in my pierced ears. I put on four pairs of earrings in my pierced ear. I'm probably being over probably over analyzing the sentence, but okay, let's break this down. I lost my place. I put on four pair pairs of earrings in my pierced ears. Well, what would your ears be if you if they weren't pierced? Seriously. That's all I have to I put on four pairs of earrings in my pierced ears. Well, that's a shock. I didn't know your ears are pierced. Sorry, going, continuing on. And my hair was kind of a messy bun. My friend Willow, author's note, Raven, this is you. Woo to Raven, whoever the hell you are. I don't think you want to be associated with this horrible crap. Woke up and then grinned at me. She flipped her long waist raven black hair with pink streaks and opened her forest green eyes. She put on her Marilyn Manson t-shirt with black mini fishnets and pointy high-heeled boots. We put on our makeup. Jesus Christ. Again with the black? We get it, you're fucking goth. Black lipstick, white foundation, and black eyeliner. whoop de doo O-M-F-G. I saw you talking to Draco Malfoy yesterday. She said excitedly. Yeah, so? I said blushing. Do you like Draco? She asked as we went out of the slithering common room and into the great hall. No, I so fucking don't, I shouted. Yeah, right. She exclaimed. Then Draco walked up to me. Hi, he said. Hi. I rep I reply flirtly. I I how do you reply hi flirt? Hi. Hi. Sorry, I'm just trying to break down how you reply hi flirtly. Hi. 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 Okay, we're done with that. Guess what? He said. What? I asked. Well, good Charlottes are having a concert in Hogsmeade, he told me. Oh my fucking god, I screamed. I love GC. They are my favorite band, besides MCR. Well, do you want to go with me? He asked. I gasped. <gasps> So, this is pretty much me just reading chapter 1 and 2, um, kind of dramatically, kind of failing at it. I hope it was up to par. I mean, I'm not trying to compete with Jade, because Jade, honestly, you're amazing. And I just, honestly, I'm just trying to have some fun. <laughs> um, if you guys want me to read the whole thing, uh, believe it or not, this crap is has 35 chapters. I know. Calm your tits. Calm your tits. Um, but if you want me to read all 35 chapters, dramatically or non-dramatically, 
uh, let me know and I'll get right on it. Um, I hope I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you all later. This is Jess signing off. Have a good night.